channel make sure to hit the subscribe button down below to become an official ex babe but today's video is going to be a braces q a and last time i did a braces q a was i believe a year and a half ago so it's been a quite a while and i have been constantly getting questions on my youtube channel instagram and twitter all the time so i just decided why not just do a video on it again so i posted a video up on my YouTube channel asking you guys to ask me questions and I got I believe 26 so I'm going to make this intro nice and short so we can go ahead and get started in the video also if you have not checked out my whole braces series I will have the playlist linked down below as well and if you like this video make sure to give it a big thumbs up and without further ado let's go ahead and get to the questions it was literally the shortest intro I've ever done so I have all the questions pulled up on my phone and it is rainbow because of my filter. But the first question is asked by Silverfan and she said, how many metal bands do you wear? Not the rubber bands, I mean the metal rings around your back molars. They're called molar bands. I have two, one back here and one back here. She also asked how put them on, which I think she means how do you put them on. They put them on for you. What they do is they, uh, they have a bunch of different sizes and they just kind of size it on your tooth. So first they'll size it and make sure it fits properly and there's no gaps and then once it fits properly then they'll go ahead and put the glue on it and then stick it on your tooth and you'll just like bite down in like wherever they put the tool and it just pushes it down um, and that's pretty much how they put them on. She also asked do you wear more appliances like headgear, expander, or habrist? Um, and no, I do not wear headgear or anything. All I wear is my braces and then rubber bands. That's pretty much it. Um, I have not had any other appliances like that. I will insert some clips here on the screen of what my braces look like right now. And I'm super happy with them. And they're actually like really straight and I'm really surprised. Next question was asked by Duh Nax. I think that's it. It's D-U-H-H-N-A-C-K or X. My bad. I'm totally butchering that. And she said, will braces pay off in the end? And yes, I am only, you know, answering this question because I truly believe that braces are going to pay off in the end. Like, I am so happy with my braces right now. And I still have about one, two, maybe three or four months left in treatment. And I, like, if they took them off now, I'd be completely satisfied because they are, like, straight and they're white. And I'm, like, so happy with them. So, yes, braces will pay off in the end. Next question was asked by Rain Whores. I think that's how you say it. <laughs> what a weird name. Um, but she asked, what color rubber bands do you like the best? By the way, I love you, girly. Love you, too. And I think my favorite one by far was this light blue. And it actually looks, when they put it on, it looks just like the Periwinkle color by Essie. It looks like this when it's on your teeth. And I love it. I feel like it makes my um, teeth look really white. And I don't know, it's just, it was probably my favorite color. And I've had this color on for like six months and then I changed once last month and then I was like, no, I'm going back to my regular one because I like it better. Next question is asked by BeautyLove1801 and she asked, when did you first get your braces on? Do you usually coordinate the colors with the seasons? So the day that I got my braces on was May 8th of 2014. So I've had them on for quite a while. It's been like probably over a year and a half since I've had my braces on. And to answer the second question, no, I honestly hate coordinating my braces colors with the seasons. The next question was asked by Teeth Enable and she said, hi, can you please do close-ups of what your braces and molar bands look like in details? Also, how to put on the rubber bands and how to take them off in close-up too. Thank you. So yes, I will insert those right now on the screen. They're actually really easy to put in the rubber bands. I mean, now when I, like I just got them back. So when I went to put them back on, I was like, oh, I know how to do this. And one snapped in my mouth and I was like, oh, that's one thing I do not miss. So yes, uh, I will do close-ups on the screen showing you guys how to do that. And yeah, I'm going off my phone and my notebook. It ain't working well. Next question was asked by Basic Beauty Guru 12 and she said, by the way, I'm getting braces in a couple of months and my question is, what food can you not eat? Another question is, how long have you had your braces on and when are you getting them off? And lastly, do they have mint green color? So to answer the first question, um, I will list all the main foods that I do not recommend eating 
during your braces treatment. Now they do give you a humongous list of things you cannot eat, but I would just list the main things that I have not tried to eat or nor will I eat with braces because I don't feel like, you know, ruining anything. So I will leave that list down below in the description box. And to answer your other question, um, I have mine on for about a year and a half, maybe a little bit over that. And the other question was, when are you getting them off? And if you guys are subscribed to my vlog channel, I did a braces update video. And that was when I went to the ortho last Wednesday and I found out when I get my braces off. So I get my braces off on April 5th and I'm super excited and I will vlog that day because why not? I mean, it's an exciting day and yeah. And then lastly she asked, do they have mint green colors? So the colors of the bands that each orthodontist has are actually different. Um, like I could have mint green, but other people couldn't. Um, I don't think mine does. They might, I'm not sure. I've never like looked at that color. But it just really depends on what the ortho has and you know, what they have in their little case of bands. Next question is asked by Taylor K 101 and she said, how long did you have your have your braces and what was the worst experience you had during the time that you had them on also did the orthodontist ever catch you for not wearing your bands or for eating popcorn so to answer the question first question I've already answered that so the worst experience that I've had with braces is like probably my most hated thing is when you get sores and you bite your cheek and it, the like the brackets just make it worse. I think sores are probably the worst thing of my braces treatment that I found. And then to answer the other question, um, no, my orthodontist, I like, when they gave me rubber bands, I've always worn my rubber bands, so that was never a problem for me. Uh, but no, I've not been caught for eating popcorn, which I've only eaten it maybe three times during my whole treatment. The next question was asked by Kaylee Elizabeth, and she asked, what color braces do you recommend? So I will have a list on the screen of the colors that I do recommend, but I have them on my notebook as well. So the first color I recommend is light blue, pink, purple, silver, or black. Those are probably my favorite colors to choose from. Uh, now these can vary from different people, but these are just the colors that I like to choose from. The next two questions are asked by Beauty is Me 12, and she said, "Is they weird when you first had your braces on?" So yes, they are weird because you are putting metal in your mouth, and it is a foreign object, and you're not used to it. So yes, it is weird at first. She also asked, "Are they hurt when you eat?" The answer to this is yes, because every month when you get your adjustments for the first like maybe one to two days your mouth will hurt um, so eating is definitely a pain for the first couple days after each monthly adjustment next question is asked by simply Isha simply Isha Aisha I don't know how to say that I'm like totally being a butcher right now um, she said can you tell me about spacers do they do spacers hurt and how long have you had them in for so spacers are pretty much a little tiny rubber band that look like these that are just like they don't like hook to anything but what they do is they put them between your molar tooth and your very back tooth to kind of create the separation to put a molar band on um, and they'll just stick it in between those two teeth and then I had mine in for 24 hours and yes it did hurt because the the spacers they put in are actually a lot thicker than the rubber bands you wear so I was like freaking out and like my back tooth hurt and I actually had those in for 24 hours before I went and got my molar bands on the next day so that's pretty much what spacers are. The next two questions are asked by Makeup Lover Lee and she said hey how long have you had your braces which I've already answered this and how old were you when you got them? I was 14 when I got my braces and then she also asked what color bands have you had throughout your whole time having braces? So I wrote this down as well because I've had quite a bit. So these are all the colors that I've had throughout treatment from beginning to now. And I've had purple, pink, teal, teal and black, light blue, black, silver, and neon purple. So those were all the colors I have had. Um, a little all over the place, a little crazy, but those are the colors I've had. Megan Murr asked, are you happy with the overall braces experience? Love you, Nicole. Love you too, and yes, I am actually completely satisfied with my braces right now, and if they literally took them off now, I'd be completely happy. So yes, I am very happy and excited about my overall braces experience. 
So thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give a big thumbs up and hit the subscribe button down below. Also, if you guys have any other questions that I have not answered in this video, make sure to comment them down below as well, and I will just respond to those. Um, and yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Also, make sure to go subscribe to my vlog channel if you're not already and go watch that Braces update video. It is very helpful and has a lot of information of what I've been going through with my braces lately. And yeah, so I will talk to you guys in my next video and I cannot wait for you guys to see it because it is going to be a bomb AF. So yeah, I will catch you guys in Friday's video. Bye! Hold up.